Hey guys, my name is Elena, I'm a graphic designer and welcome to my graphic design channel and today I'm going to show you how to create a logo type in Adobe Illustrator. We will create a logo type for ice cream shop and it's called Sweet. And if you're interested, then keep watching. Not all your customers are designers, so you need to show your logotype in real life. And how to show them in real life? You need to use mockups to show a life of your logotype. I have video about mockups on my YouTube channel and how to use mockups. Now I'm going to show you how my logotype will be look in real life. When you create presentation of your logotype, you need to show your logotype from the best side. So you need to use mockups that can show all life of your logotype. For my logotype, I used mockup of uh, ice cream packaging, scene and windows and as well bag that can be used in ice cream shop. The full presentation you will find on my Telegram channel absolutely free. You can go to my Telegram channel now and look at PDF file with my presentation. And I invite you to my Telegram channel to find their interesting information about graphic design, my thoughts about graphic design and a chat with designers where you can talk with each other and of course sometimes with me. So I'm waiting for you on my Telegram channel and as well PDF file of presentation of our logotype is waiting for you. And now let's start to draw logotype in Adobe Illustrator. This is my workspace and these are colors which I'm going to use in my tutorial. As well you will find colors and fonts in my PDF file on my Telegram channel. And as well you will find link on fonts below this video. My workspace and colors are ready. And now let's take orange color and or polygon tool or star tool and create triangle free okay rotate make it longer and wider now direct function tool select that point and draw on the corner Okay, now rounded rectangle tool and create rounded rectangle here. Select both shapes, align. Now we need to take a red color. Hold shift to make perfect circle and send the circle to back, move a little up and make copy, hold ALT and make copy. Now green color. Now let's um, copy and paste that orange shape, select the copy and green ellipse and uh, pathfinder minus front ungroup delete unwanted part now select red ellipse and uh, take violet color in the stroke the size will be 10 and here the same violet color in the stroke the size 10 now we need to delete the line here now we need to add a point here with add anchor point tool 
add here the point, direct selection tool, select the point and delete on your keyboard. Bring that shape to front. Okay, let's move on. Now uh, let's uh, make bring that uh, shape to uh, a little up. Uh, now select that shape and make it a little thinner, I would say, or smaller. Move that ellipse a little up. Now uh, select that shape, violet color in the stroke, the size 10. And the same here. Okay. Now we need to delete here some uh, elements of the line. We need to take add anchor point tool and let's add points. Here are the first point. You need to add it straight to the line. One more point and one more here. Direct section tool, select that point and delete on your keyboard. Okay, and again add anchor point tool and delete that point okay now line tool hold shift to make straight line and create here the line okay guys it's line icon it's logotype from line icon line icons it's one of the most popular icons now we uh, make the stroke with rounded corners and uh, line icons uh, is the most commercial icons. And guys, I want to invite you to my course Commercial Portfolio Step Up. Why you need my course and what will be on my course, you will know on my course website. Uh, I have two levels of my course, all information as well on my course website and what to do if you just starting in graphic design and in Adobe Illustrator you will find on my course website and as well you will find checklist for testing your knowledge in Adobe Illustrator. So if you're interested to create your first commercial portfolio with me, you can come to my course. Uh, I have uh, here reviews of my students and students works uh, in every review you will find portfolio of my student and here you will find student works you can see some designs of my students and here you can understand what you will do on my course and as well you will find below this video book presentation of my course and if you're interested in my course i'm waiting for you and let's make a step in graphic design together let's move on now we need to take a rectangle tool with green color in the fill and create the rectangle like that Make the copy, make it longer, like this. Now direct section tool and select these two corners and round the corner, the same here. Select two points and round the corner. Okay, now uh, let's add the stroke the size the same 10 and 10 here okay let's uh, take direct section tool and select that 
that line, select that point and move a little to the left to make it a little shorter. Now here we need to delete the line, the line, that line. We need to add point here. Direct section tool, select the point, delete the line. Move that points, those points, a little down. Like that. Uh, now the same with the second shape. We need to delete uh, to delete the line. Okay, take add anchor point tool, add the point, direct section tool, select the point in the center and delete on your keyboard. And move those points down with direct selection tool. Okay, now let's fix here details. Here we need to object expand. Now uh, ungroup, move that green shape a little up and select this shape and move like that. Now the same here, object expand, ok, ungroup and move green shape a little up, ok, now it's perfect. Now let's take pen tool and violet color in the stroke and now I'm going to create a line with pen tool and after I'm going to uh, copy and paste that line to make shape of the woofle. Okay, now hold out make copies and we need the same side, size, uh, it's 10 and just copy and paste the line and make the shape and we need a rounded option for the stroke now select all elements here object expand appearance ok or expand now uh, shape builder tool hold out and delete unwanted parts and here let's select this shapes and delete unwanted part here. Ok, it's done. Select it, move a little up, you can group it. The icon is ready, now we need to create the text. Let's will be the size 100, let's write sweet. Ok, red color. Now let's take the font. You will find the fonts below the tutorial. Create outlines. Make it a little bigger. Hold shift to save proportions. Ok, now arc tool. Make arc. Rotate. The color, let it be the red, no matter the what color will be. Bring here. Now we need to take a uh, type on path tool and let it be here 15 and let's write ice cream. The size let it be here 25 and the font Gilroy, the light and let it be here 20. Mm, ok, now let's take uh, text tool. Put the mouse in the beginning and uh, move a little and let's change uh, the color to violet. Create outlines, ok, select, it's ready, you can 
uh, go to object expand appearance okay put here now make copy if you want to make it smaller you need at first to go to uh, object shape expand shape to save proportions make it smaller put here copy or you can copy it after ungroup now we need delete, to delete all colors ungroup all elements delete all colors and after we delete all colors we need to delete unwanted parts of our uh, logo type i i'm going to make a white and dark logo type and make a small presentation of our logo type we are going to delete unwanted parts with shape builder tool so select these shapes and delete that part and now let's delete the green color and group here delete and delete here so we have here unwanted lines now let's select this shape and move a little up like that and here select these two shapes shape builder tool hold all the delete unwanted part and the same here okay and now the last one let's ungroup that shape delete red color now we need to select some shapes this one that one and this one and shape builder tool and delete that part okay the line icon of our logo type is ready okay it's transparent icon let's make it violet color here okay now let's take that color for the background create here uh, the rectangle the rectangle tool and send to back now you can make the copy of the rectangle okay make it smaller like this red color now uh, let's select that icon hold out make copy and make it uh, you can make it that color or you can just take white color you can expand it okay and now we created a small presentation of our logotype uh, in three colors with color dark color and white color and guys if you want to know more about presentation of course i'm talking a lot about presentation of my course and uh, i'm talking a lot of about freelancing or if you want to sell your design on stocks like shutterstock or mm, uh, adobe stock or others i have information about it on my course so if you're interested to create the first commercial portfolio with me you can come and i hope you like my tutorial and if yes please give me a like and subscribe and see you in the next tutorials in adobe illustrator or in the next videos about a graphic design bye bye guys bye